Hi, everyone. Welcome to Conversations with Nicole. Red Silk Media Group presents a speed networking event in Florence, South Carolina for small business owners and entrepreneurs. Today, my guests are Shay Pinto Martinez, the owner of Red Silk Media Group, and Marcus Evans of Sounds by Marcus. Together, all of us are going to be involved in this event and host it for those that will be attending. And we are so excited. Good to see both of you. You too. Thank you for having me back on. Thank you for having me, Nicole. Long time no see. Exactly. Long time no see. I'm thrilled to be a part of this event, Shay, that you are organizing and bringing Marcus and I in together to help host this event. Tell people all about this speed networking event. Oh, yeah, definitely. It's going to be a great event, Um, a chance for entrepreneurs, small business owners and investors alike to come together collaborate, get to know each other, and hopefully piggyback off our ideas and just invest in each other. Um, We don't have enough networking events in the Florence County community. So what I want to do is be able to partner those investors, those entrepreneurs together to help them grow and build their businesses. And tell folks when it is and when they can start signing up for this. The beautiful thing about this, it's a free event. Yes. So everything is free from the vendors that are participating. They're going to have tables set up to all the people that are actually going to attend. The whole event is free. Um, It's going to be at the Florence Downtown Tech Campus, the Business Incubator Building, Thursday night, June 1st, from 6 to 9 p.m. You can register on Eventbrite as early as April 1st. That's wonderful. And one thing it about the uh, business incubator building at Tech, it's a hidden gem and a great treasure and tool for small businesses and entrepreneurs. So the perfect place to host this event. Yes, exactly. So the business incubator already houses several small businesses, startups, businesses that have been here for a little while. We actually have Diversified Magazine that's been in the Florence area, I think at least the last six to seven years, maybe a little longer, that started off here in the Incubate and they're still here growing. So this is a perfect spot to host this event, to bring them in and see what the incubator is all about and what it has to offer um, and to connect those investors to say, you know what, I want to see what we can do to help these small businesses get off the floor and get them running. So that's what the purpose of this networking event is for. Well, Marcus and I are kind of like small businesses ourselves, as you are. So we're delighted to be a part of this event. We'll be going live on our social media platforms and interviewing folks as they come in. And Marcus, tell us a little bit about your business and what you do and what you'll be doing at the event. So actually, I am now a DJ. So I actually have my own radio show on TTT Radio Network called the Marcus, Marcus B. and Marcus Show. And I'm also pretty popular on TikTok right now. So I use those platforms not just to spread the music that I bring, but also I try to spread some positivity, positive message, and some comedy as well. So it's always fun. Well, that's exciting. And you and I, as you alluded to earlier, have known each other for a long time. And so it's going to be fun to collaborate together with you as you are hosting on your show with all of the things you just mentioned, talking to the people as they come in, hopefully giving us some great music too. It is Sounds by Marcus, right? (laughs) Exactly, exactly. So it'll be fun to really showcase this event in a really fun way. And I, I know I'm excited about it, Shay. Thank you for the opportunity to work with you. So what else do we want people to know so they can get excited about coming on board and attending? So we're going to have investors here. We're going to have bankers here from various banks in the local Florence County um, area. Um, We're going to have vendors. They're going to showcase from food to um, drinks and different things like that as well. Pam Little McDaniel from Florence One Schools, known as The Voice, will be actually hosting the networking event to to make sure that everyone is connecting and moving around as they're supposed to in the time frame that's allowed, if you will. So the whole event, like you said earlier, will be live streamed on various platforms. It'll be on Facebook. It'll be on Instagram, LinkedIn, YouTube, <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> so the, in the beginning, 
all the vendors and the small businesses will be able to be interviewed by Nicole Boone, and they will be able to use that interview later on in their own businesses for many commercials, infomercials, to promote their businesses. So this networking event is more than just getting to know each other. It's also a way for these businesses to grow and market themselves to their wide community. Do you think that's sort of the challenge, probably one of the biggest challenges that small businesses and entrepreneurs have is making the connection to people that they can say, hey, what I've got going on is a good product, a good service. Invest in me because it helps you. This really is the connection of this speed networking event, correct? Yes, yes. Most people, when they think about small businesses, they don't know that there's a lot of capital initial investment that has to go into it. And a lot of people that start their business, they don't know where to find that capital investment. You see TV shows like Shark Tank. Not everyone is going to be able to go on Shark Tank and get that 50 to $100 million to invest in their small business, right? Those but, people scare me anyway. I've watched them. Many, many <laughs> Exactly. Right. I'm like, well, I don't want to my business. Like, I don't want to give a part of my business away so I can get this investment, right? But the little secret that a lot of people don't know is that the banks have to invest in local area businesses. They have to be able to say and justify that they have a certain percentage that they meet every year, every quarter, even. So to help the local economy continue to grow and thrive. And a lot of times, too, when we think about small businesses, it's not necessarily the brick and mortar. It can come in different ways and shapes and forms as far like like Marcus and like me as I'm working on growing my social media platforms to get the word out about what I do as well. It's not necessarily going into a shop anymore. Right, right. So small business will be anything from, you know, starting out in your basement, right? to a virtual site, um, to being in an incubator like at the Florence Arlington Tech Center. So it, there's no um, traditional mode anymore, if you will. You know, it could be physical, it could be virtual, it could be all online. So, yeah. The good thing, too, though, is this is an opportunity to really meet face to face. And still, I think there is something to be said with that personal contact, you know, get to shake someone's hand, get to look them in the eye and get to really sell what you're doing. So that really yeah. is um, a benefit of why someone would want to come and be involved in the speed networking event. Yes, because when you start a small business, you are the face of that business. You are your brand. And so you have to be able to explain why do I want to invest in you, right? What makes my business a good investment for the company, for the bank, for your community that you're serving? What is it that you offer that's different from everyone else in your field? And this networking event will give you that opportunity, that platform to present that to possible investors, possible connections that you can collaborate with, possible clients. So yeah, it's, it's going to be a great event. I'm excited. Marcus, are you excited? If you're not, you better be now. <laughs> I'm pumped. I'm pumped. It's, just, it, it's another opportunity to perform. That's all it is. It's another opportunity to uh, meet new clients, um, meet new people, interact, network. It's, it's always fun. So I'm most definitely excited and thank you for our opportunity. You know, and I think too, even though you've been around in the Florence area for a long time and I've been in the media for a long time covering the Florence, South Carolina, PD, Grand Strand area. I bet there will be somebody still new to meet. And that's what makes this a great event. Right, Shay? Yes, yes. And it's open to the surrounding areas, too. So we have people that are coming as far out as Columbia and the opposite side of Darlington to Chesterfield County um, from Marion and Conway, the opposite way. So it's really open up to people from all around the area because we want them to not only feel like they're connected, but to get those connections they need to grow. Does that make sense? It sure does. We're all about connecting and growing 100%. Well, I think we've just about covered everything for this event. Registration starts April 1st on Eventbrite. The event is actually June 1st, correct? At Tech yes. 6 to 9. So what else do we need to know before we close things up here today, Shay? 
dress to impress. Do not wear tennis shoes and t-shirts. Come looking professional. You know, you are your brand. So present yourself as such. I love that. Dress to impress. Marcus, we got to make sure we do that now. <laughs> We're on it. We're on it. <laughs> Shay, thank you so much for this opportunity for us to be involved and for this opportunity with you and Marcus today to share the word about the Speed Neck Working event coming up. I'm excited. Me too. I'm so thankful that both of you guys are going to be a part of this and I just expect great things from it. We sure hope so, don't we, Marcus? We do not want to disappoint. You got it. (laughs) All right. Well, thank you all both very much. And that will do it for this edition of Conversations with Nicole. Until I see you again, I hope you have a great day.